thank you to Tokyo Treat and Sakura Co. for sponsoring this video. It's time for me to get my bag. And I get it. If you don't care about the sponsor section, at least check out the comments for the discount code KAKA to get $5 off your first purchase for either of the boxes. But Tokyo Treat and Sakura Co. were nice enough to send us new boxes to check out. Let's see what they got for us today. Let's take a look at the boxes. Here's Tokyo Treat. We got the standard orange. And then here comes Sakura Co. The color is... The same as last month. It is what it is. Look at it. Nice and red packaging. Let's check out Tokyo Treat Box first. This month, July theme is Okinawa Snack and Oasis. You can see the pamphlet right there. It's all like beach, summer themed. Okinawa Beach, you know how it goes. This month at Tokyo Treat invites you to get a taste of the island life and adventure at Japan's most popular getaway destinations. Okinawa. This month's box is packaged full of tropical flavors and Okinawan favorites you don't want to miss, right? Some of the highlights, it's definitely the Kit Kat cookies. There is this like grape jelly one that's really good too. That snack one is good. Of course, we got the standard ramen, the drink. And here's the box. For the Soccer Coast side, the theme of this month is called the Festival of Tohoku. Before we get into that, usually there's like a monthly tableware item that comes in the form like a tea tray or like a set. This month, instead of that, we have a traditional Japanese towel right you here. This is called a Neko Tenegui. Now, Tohoku is known for its lively and colorful festivals. Offer is a captivating display of culture and tradition. This month, Sakurako invites you to indulge in authentic and savory flavors that capture the essence of this Tohoku celebrations. My favorite one, that cookie was pretty good, but this jelly right here, that was peak. It's so sweet. It's so chewy. I love it. Now, if you're still here, I applaud you with all I got, but technically you might have wasted your time. Why? Because I don't really make money off of you watching the sponsor section of this video. I make the money by you using the affiliate code to buy the product. And I get it. If you don't have a personal interest in this product, no one really likes getting pushed sponsored content in their face. However, I think these boxes could make great gifts for friends and family that wants to experience Japan at the comfort of their own home. And listen, trying to do content creation full time, it's pretty hard. But sponsorships like this along the way definitely does help. And you don't have to use the affiliate code. But if you're generous enough and you'd like to support me trying to do this full time, I would truly appreciate it if you would use the pinned comment affiliate code Kaka for five dollars off your first purchase now on to the anime reaction i know that i'm a little bit late with this this is called the elusive samurai and i did not expect it to do well on my channel so i kind of skipped but baldy bro baldy is popping off the elusive samurai now he has a different audience than mine but i still want to test it out so we're gonna check out one episode and if it doesn't do well with community effort if it has to rely on tourists to do well nope that's not what we're looking for i hope that you guys will enjoy it let's check out episode one 2024 Way back in the past, like Kamakura Wakamiyauji Shogunate site. So Shogun system exists. This is like a young a ninja. Super, super agile. <laughs> I see him kind of. His voice acting alone makes me feel comfortable. Okay. Quell the former emperor's uprising, as in he's gonna go over there for war to prevent Godaigo's uprising. Hojo clan, that's us? <laughs> I'm gonna just assume that all this plan is gonna go to shit and everyone's gonna die and bro's gonna be alone. <laughs> 
Dude, the designs are so cool. You know what's fucked up? <laughs> Why is the boy cuter than the girl? This is our betrothed? God damn, bro. Tokyo-sama! Where did you go? Did you go there? Oh, my God. 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 That's her dad? Bro is not there. This is Joe Biden. This is the current president of the United States, bro. It's just a corpse just being dragged around. Sir, you can't be saying that, sir. Wake up. Wake up. He is not there. This girl is very kind, huh? He hid inside a chest of arm for two days? What? Also, what's with this repeated Hyrule? Isn't this like the Trinity sign? Like the uh, Zelda, right? I forget the meaning of this, but is, is this not like the Trinity? Triforce, exactly, right? This is copyright. No, you can't copyright. You can't just copyright these triangles. No, they're just geometry. You can't just do that, but it's everywhere. <laughs> Not here. My man is Houdini. Hmm. We're kind of in a pretty dire situation. Like, I don't think the kid realizes, though. Best friends? Firstborn brother. Oh! Really? That's why this kid always runs, too? You can't catch him. Parkour! Damn it! You can't do that. Wistoria? Or Elusive Samurai. What's better animated? I think these two are the best animated animes that we've seen so far. Excluding story, excluding everything else. In terms of just pure animations, Wistoria and this one kind of stands in their own different tier. Wouldn't you say so? They put a lot of effort into this. There's a lot of care put into the animation. Like, it's just... It's just so crazy what a different experience is. Watching an anime where the studio actually gave a fuck. And like, didn't min-max, didn't try to just like, make all of this dark and have shitty CGI and try to hide it. All the, you know, assets and background characters are actually drawn in. Does it need to be for it to be a good anime? I don't think so. But it's just interesting to see like, the quality difference in pure animations in this and with Storia versus the you know, other anime airing this season. <laughs> of the ones that we've checked out anyways. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that's a lord! Never mind, everyone's just happy. Everything is too happy right now. Everything is just way too happy, happy, go lucky. I fully expect, like, tragedy to incur, right? There's no way this is gonna be just a happy story, right? We're getting set up, I think. Who jinxed it, kid? This is a flag. Oh, oh, you shouldn't have said this, kid. Here we go. Oh, a bell sound. Monster asleep within you. Behind you, hey. Hello. Oh. Why is it shiny? 
This guy's a con man, isn't he? This guy's gotta be a con man. Is this Gojo Satsuno's voice? It is? Oh, it is. <laughs> there, yeah, he, there's a lot of aura for sure. <laughs> yeah, bro is sounding like Arataki Reigen in Mob Psycho. He's probably a con man, right? He's got like a flashlight thing behind him. There's no flash on it back in this era, but you know what I mean. <laughs> ジャクにします。私は鎌倉を敵と称しました。この子は雫。技術。Like don't spoil it. Is it bad? What's going on? The biggest con man, bro. The biggest con man, man. This guy's a scam artist. I, that is true, right? If, if, if he actually told us, it'd be spoiling the anime. But like, the things here is like, oh, maybe this. Nah, maybe that. Oh, but this is actually good. Oh, it's like, what the hell did you just tell? Nothing. You didn't give us one specific thing. What? This is true. Oh, what happens? Hero by the age of 10. The age of 10? Bye bye. Puppet strings. His family background. He was serious there. So fast. So based on his agility, it's like he's probably gonna be the ultimate warrior. Not by strength, but no one will be able to hit him. He'll just deflect, dodge, counter everything. What does elusive even mean? I, I kind of know, but not really. So let's look at the actual definition, right? Definition. So elusive means difficult to, difficult to find, catch, or achieve. Difficult to remember or recall. Elusive. He's just so slippery. He's just fast. He's just so nimble, agile. Elusive samurai. You can't catch him. All in on agile. All in on dex. Hmm? I don't know. That's not the head of our guy, right? Because, like, uh, we were. Uh, our, our, the big boys were going over to some place to stop the. Uh, it's to, like, quell the uprising of the past emperor, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go with the mission. Whose head was that, though? <laughs> Dude, all of these dudes got like, they're just serving. Look at their eyeliner, man. Like back in the samurai era, I know they don't have makeup like that, but look at their like, their eyelashes, the eyeliner, every one of them, man. Oh my God, every one of them is serving here. Go! What's wrong? Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> when did the sword move? He did the anime samurai thing! He did the... What? But that guy was on our side though, was he not? Is this a traitor? Right? This is our war ready to go. This dude beside us cut the guy right here. Ah! Yeah, him! Atomic samurai shoot in one punch, man. Takauji was well who knows if B guy is lying or not, but Takauji, the guy that we saw that was sending off, he was already betrayed us. 
contact with the Emperor. This is all a setup. What do we do? He has too much aura! Bro made the biggest power move, huh? This dude, I thought he was on our side, but like everyone believes in this guy too. So like everyone turned in, he's already positioned his son to be the general. What? What are we gonna do about this, huh? Nothing, I guess. I don't have to read that out. War crimes. For the boy to become a hero, holy everything just. At the halfway point, everything just changed, huh? Like as soon as the ball fell off the roof and the head dropped, it's just like, nope, no more. Everything is done. <laughs> the archer guy. <laughs> this is Takaoji, right? This is Takaoji, right? I think it is. It's the same eye color from the beginning. <laughs> like his pose, bro. He's doing the Jojo pose. Just... I can't fucking do this. <laughs> He's fucking him right now. <laughs> Baldi? Hojo clan, dad done. Do you have anyone else? Gojo! Really? But the dad is so useless. Got it. Yeah, we're It'll go to ruins? <laughs> he's doing that thing again where he starts muttering. It's like, oh, he's back to the front. Ah, that's been on. But what if I do that? But oh, I don't know. I so vague. <laughs> His face just in me. <laughs> now let me just peek into the future. Don't spoil me, though. What a dark, dark turn. I like it, though. I'm glad that it's not fucking around. <gasps> no, that might be your one dog, dude. You see the dog there? Run away, puppy. No, no, we can't save him. <laughs> this is crazy violent. Yeah, that's the main man we got to take down first. You traitor! That sounds even more scary now. What'd he say? <laughs> young Lord, you can't run from Takauji. Haha, <laughs> young Lord, I'll find you. It's all fun and cunny back then, but now it's a totally different meaning, dude. He gonna find us and kill us. Well, we haven't seen him fight yet either. It was all fake. Revenge story! <laughs> I think we can trust him. He's just the facial expressions, like you could work on that a little bit, bro. It's just way too creepy. <laughs> but he's always shining. <laughs> Is it actually holy energy? <laughs> it's just his lamp hat, right? His daughter is also saying nah. I think that's his daughter anyway. Twenty-four days, under a month, you took it down. You'll defeat Takauji. Actual skewers, war crimes, man. Jesus. Shish kebab. Was getting slaughtered after getting backstabbed by one of your most loyal members dying with honor? 
I think an honorable life is to take revenge on your clan, man. So this guy. No. No, he accepted his death there, dude. He smiled. He Gojo was like, all right, I don't got time for you. Bye bye. No, no, no. He's gonna somehow recover from this, right? See? <laughs> <laughs> If you really wanted to die, you wouldn't have done that. But your body instinctively did that to protect yourself because there is life within you. And finally, we're going to see how well he fights. We haven't seen him, right? All he's done is parkour so far. How fast and elusive is he? <laughs> Let's see it. The first test. <laughs> come, come on. Dude. I know it's part of the test, but like, look. It's the son that escaped! Get him! Get his ass! Okay. Damn! It's too quick! No, that guy's arm this guy! <laughs> this dude on the left. This dude on the left. This, he just cut this dude's arm off. What a piece of shit, dude! <laughs> Ooh. Yo, there's so many people down there! Will you rise to the challenge? Why? The visuals are absolutely stunning, bro. Holy, what is this supposed to be? Some kind of like... I don't know, uh, 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 not a pharaoh, uh, a phoenix, right? Maybe? I don't know. We're back. That was like a lesson. Careful now. Future sight. Future sight. He knows where the arrows will miss. No! No! What? This dude doesn't even need infinite in this show. In Jujutsu Kaisen, Gojo needed Mugen to block these. Here, it's like, nah. Nah, I just got that observation hockey baby. <laughs> The daughter, bro! <笑>だったんだよ。だったんだよ。だったんだよ。だったんだよ。だったんだよ。だったんだよ。だったんだよ。だったんだよ。だったんだよ。だったんだよ。だったんだよ。だったんだよ。だったんだよ。だったんだよ
く言い出してあなたに何の利益がある全ては北条家への忠義のため、really? You just confirmed that you're a fake shaman. Nah, I believe him. He's a real shaman, bro. Jima Smaina. It's Leo Hanashi Tashima Show. Anata Samaga Kono Kamakurao. Watashiwa Haji Shirazda. Itizoka Bushino Kotosh de Tosen Nanoni. Nah, resurrect your clan, dude. Let's go. Yorishiketo. Sekini wa tote marazo. So come at it. What's Kai Tashima Show? But, like, will that two years happen in this season? Well, the opening had different characters, and those characters were much older. So, like, a time skip should happen. I'm sure the season is gonna live the story of his path to becoming a hero, right? Huh! Nice little jump. What are those? Peacock feathers? And that is today's episode, or actually, well, it's today for us, but that is episode one of Elusive Samurai, and I regret not checking this out earlier, man. Oh, this is actually really good. I just didn't, you know, these kind of like um Japanese history animes, the samurai era, it's never really done well on my channel. So I thought, I saw the poster, and I'm like, this is gonna be like another one of those instances. And it could still be, but it doesn't change the fact that the anime episode was fantastic. I'm actually happy that I checked this out. And I just hope that you guys will like it on the YouTube site, because that's what really only matters if we drop or continue a series. The plot is basically eight-year-old kid living in blissful ignorance, tripped too many death flags, and now his entire clan is wiped out because Takaoji was like, nah, I'm better. And now we're, we're escaping, and throughout these two years, we're going to be training with other kids that I'm sure um, the fake shaman has recruited, and then somehow... We will take back the Hojo clan or the glory of Hojo clan and take out Takauji. Probably not gonna happen in the span of season one, but like, it's looking to be a pretty good revenge plot. And that's it for me. If you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlists for more content. And until next time, take care.